Hi guys, Colleen here with a junk journal with me. Today I'm doing day 20 of the junk journal September challenge and it's ink. And I've got this tiny little page here from an Edith Holden book. And I was thinking of popping the title here on a few wee bits. And then I've got this lovely bit of blank page here to do some other stuff. So I'm just going to move this over so it's sort of in the middle. There we go. So this is my folder. <laughs> um, I do need to get something else. But this started out as my folder for my stamps. Um, but it's sort of overflowing a wee bit. Um, so I'm literally going to grab some out of here. Um, and we've got all my inks in here too. And my wee block, which you can see, I don't think I've ever used. I usually just use my fingers and then they get pretty messy. So I've got black, I've got purple, and let's see, we've got different shades of purple. I sort of guess colour scheme already. Um, the wee ink pads I just got from AliExpress. Um, a lot of these stamps have come from AliExpress. start with this. So, um, this side then, just wondering if I had anything that looked like a bit of a tag, but I don't think I do. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop down like a wee border and then put the title up here. really primed that first. I do actually probably need to get new ink. I've had this ink a while now, although I haven't really don't use it that often, to be honest. So there we go. Not too bad. Um, you'll see by the end why I don't use it too often, because I will be covered absolutely covered in ink. Um, this little uh, fountain pen, I nearly forgot the name of it there, I got an Asda on sale and I think it was like 25p or something. So I grabbed one for me and one for my daughter as we both like pens. So I don't do <laughs> I don't do pretty pretty writing at all. Uh, I would love to be able to do pretty writing, but um, not at the minute. Just thought it'd be nice to do the the title with a fountain pen, just because the prompt is ink. Now, I think I've just put my arm in the ink, and I don't know where I put my lid. Right, we'll find that later. Now, let's see if we are in frame. Okay, so that's our title, and then I thought maybe. of the smaller um, stamps. Might be nice to go on this page. See, I'm not very good at this at all. 
Um, I'll clean all my stamps at the end, I think. Um, let's see, I do want to use my dragonfly. I haven't used this one yet. I think I bought this on a D stash. It doesn't look like it's been used at all. So, I'll prime it. I think I'm going to do it multicolored purple. So I'm still behind with the challenge, um, but I am really enjoying it. Let's see if I can, yeah, there we go. Not quite sure how that's going to turn out. Not too bad, actually. Could have been a lot worse. Um, and then let's see what else we have. Um, I have to do a butterfly. So we do. I'll do black ink for it. Put it down here. And then I think that we one instead had some roses on it. So let's see. Um, do the roses this light purple. Trying to see now uh, which way up that needs to go. That really light purple, you can hardly see. Let's see if I can do that again. Probably not. Okay, and then let's get something for the side. Um, and I'll do black with this one. The other thing is, I think you're really supposed to stamp it once on a bit of scrap paper and then stamp it on your um, work. But I don't think my camera would um, last that long to do all that. Um, so I just need something for under here. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. That's me rummaging in my in my folder again. We've got this sort of love, which I've never used. Um. So let's see. Should I get the normal purple? There we go. And then over the page, this is going to be um, sort of the other side of the ink. Um, I'm going to need to cover that up, I think, with something. What shall we cover that up with? Maybe do a little flag of this. Let's see. I'm just hoping my camera doesn't cut out on me. Um... straight by any stretch of the imagination. Okay, 
pop that up there and then just pop our little title on it again. pen this time and I'm not sure let's see Oh, that's for me, that's the phone, and if it's for me, my hand's gonna, <laughs> gonna let it go there now in a second. Um, okay, yes, that was my, <laughs> it was for me, so there we go. Oops. Right, so I've got this, um, stamp here. I don't think I've ever used this one either. It's quite big, so it's quite a lot harder to ink up properly. So, and this is where I get absolutely covered in ink. Okay, it's not too bad. And then I've got a little coffee pot here. Well, not a coffee pot. Um, a little drinks container, hot drinks container. And I've started university again this week. And my class on Friday starts at nine fifteen, which means I have to be, I have to get the um, six o'clock train or bus, sorry, to be up there in time on the 10 past 7 train. So we are going to need lots and lots and lots and lots of coffee. Although I don't drink coffee. I hate coffee. It's tea, but it's still in one of these wee containers. And let's see, one last one to go along the bottom. Um. These wee ones, the coffee ones, I got from the works. Let's see, I'll do this one two toned. Try and get this finished before my camera decides it's not happy anymore. But first coffee. And Get that with donuts. And we'll do a dark purple. To go along with the coffee. Hello, it's a cinnamon swirl I usually get if I can. So that is my spread for ink. So we've got the lovely Eden Holdeth, um, Eden, Edith Holden page in the background. Um, and my stamps, as you can see. And look, 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 look. See, this is why I don't use stamps normally. So if you enjoyed this video, I'd really appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. If you consider subscribing, that would be even better. And I'll see you next time. Bye.